guys, today we have a driving mode, short and clear video about similar topic like uh, video before about the problematic that people who are spiritual minded, who are uh, positive, uh, heart centered people face when we speak about improving income, bettering income, financial future, business growth, general uh, financial, good things, valuable things, values connected to the financial aspect of life. And here actually, when I went to some responses, uh, messages, emails I got as a reaction to that video, I understood more and more that's something I have been noticing but I think I have a new yeah I definitely have a new confirmation to the topic that I want to share with you today and it's pretty interesting so subject matter which I would like to share with you today is in order to grow your income in order to grow your prosperity, abundance, wealth, income potential, earning potential, it's not even important if you are spiritual minded or not, if you are uh, financially oriented, if you are uh, good with, with certain skills connected with finances or not, it's, it's, it's not at all about that because and I can use examples of the proverbs and statements is that like attracts like and uh, uh, discover your passion and money will come and money like speed and uh, um, when you change inside everything will change outside of you and general categorization of the personal growth and financial growth as such but you see what 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 is really a, a problem what really you have to think about in my opinion we all have to think about and and deal with is the understanding about the real nature inner nature real real nature of the wealth and abundance the real nature of, of prosperity wealth abundance is not only connected to money to green papers or blue red whatever color papers and coins that represent only that serve as a via medium via medium of the well exchange of values money is just a monetary material tool that we use to express the amount of wealth and abundance I am pretty sure that most of you are clear about that but if that is the case then what is the real nature what actually is wealth abundance well my friends here is where, where the topic gets hot <laughs> and very interesting and very appealing even to those who didn't really went deeper into shortcut of having more or any other uh, maybe personal growth and uh, uh, wealth building prosperity growth prosperity building program the real nature of becoming wealthy, becoming abundant, is more near to spiritual principles, and I will explain what I mean by that, than to material principles. For me, when I say spiritual, does not mean a sectarian religious understanding of the spirituality. Spiritual for me means 
and let's me let me define by the qualities let's be pragmatical what is spiritual the end conclusion could be the spiritual is the hundred like 180 degrees opposite totally opposite from material why the nature of spiritual nature of the soul of the spirit is diametrically opposite from the nature and the qualities which we find in matter in dead matter yes and I say dead matter here is why spirit spiritual energy or, or let me start with material for some of you it may be more um, easier to, to to agree with me or to criticize me or to get your own opinion about that whatever material everything but is material everything which is matter is created or born it grows or expands for some time it it reaches to certain peak of development of the growth of the ripeness it starts to deteriorate to shrink to go down to, to disappear and in the end it dies it dissolves it disappears that's material described in short way but pretty direct isn't it? spiritual nature is opposite which means it never is born it never starts to exist it exists eternally in some way shape or form it it's always there it's all pervade it it always grow it, it's always constantly there it's filled with and it never dies it never dies it never deteriorates it never disappears it's always present it may uh, may it may change the sh uh, shape or form uh, but it's always present and uh, now a second comparison it's always opposite in, rela in relation to the attributes as well like matter everything is material is always more inclined it's filled with ignorance which means for example if you don't switch uh, light on there is a darkness if there is no sun there is a darkness that's material spiritual means is, is, is eternally filled with light with knowledge there is no need to switch on and off lights to learn you are filled with knowledge with bliss and with light bliss joy being happy fulfilled is a spiritual quality problem however is that people seek that joyfulness that happiness that bliss from really wrong sources and that's another topic but for another video or actually for another good body of knowledge and, and, and conclusions and I, am, I have that included in, 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 in my program however for this video this is really what somehow I was feeling that I didn't share enough with you uh, not really in detail that do not be confused and be sure that if you really uh, are looking for a uh, real prosperity real abundance real wealth it cannot be based and it cannot be formed and based and rest it cannot rest only and solely on material principles those people who are um, the millions of dollars on account does not mean you are wealthy you're abundant you prosper if you are in fear if you are in uh, um, anxiety if you are not joyful with what you do if you're not contributing not sharing if you are not in the fire of your enthusiasm and not really contributing what you have to contribute to this world then no millions of trillions and billions of of dollars will will will, will, will make you abundant and make you prosperous that's the point for this video. I hope 
this created kind of um, some idea generation or rethinking ideas in your uh, mind. And uh, since I parked, that's all for to, to, for today. And I wish you all the best. And I hope to see you soon. Bye.